Hi, I'm here today to do an unboxing. I have uh, three books to open and um, I wanted to do it with you so you could uh, join in my excitement. Side note, is it an unboxing if it doesn't come in a box? First up, I have this package from B.B. Easton. And uh, if you know her, then you know what's gonna be inside this. And I am so excited. I, her first book, um, not first book, but first book in this series is Praying for Rain. And I absolutely loved it. I ordered this signed copy. So you can get signed books from B.B. on her Etsy page, which is, I think, Art by Easton. And um, so she released the next two books in that series back to back. Uh, last month and so I have been dying to get my hands on them but because I'm a crazy person I only wanted the signed copies so I ordered them from her shop and waited for them to come in <laughs> and here they are okay so fighting for rain and dying for rain and they're both gonna be signed which is like just the best so this one comes with a little sticker love stickers and it says just survive anyway love baby Yay! And then Fighting for Rain is um, a bookmark with the Rain Trilogy. And then Jess, just say, <clears throat> bad word. <laughs> but that is how these books are. So that's your warning that these are gritty, raw, dark books. They're apocalyptic and they are amazing. Bibi's such a good writer. I actually just was doing an interview for um, my book release that's happening. And um, one of the questions was if you could co-write a book with anyone, who would it be? And this is a really tough question because there are a lot of authors I really, really love and admire and would love to work with. But when it came down to it, I picked Bibi because she's so different than me. And yet similar to we've emailed a little and started writing in similar ways because um, after having children and needing to get stories out and you know, finding this thing that you can do for you and, and sharing with the world. And she's just adorable. I mean, have you seen her? Gosh, the pink hair is, I, I love her so much. But anyway, I tend to write pretty sweet stuff and she writes really dark stuff. So I think we would really balance each other out and it would be amazing. The next package I have is um, a mystery book. I got this at the Ripped Bodice. Have you heard of the Ripped Bodice? If you haven't, you should look it up. And if you live near LA, you should go visit the store. It's really, really fun. So this is a romance only bookstore and it is in LA. Um, and I was in California last week doing um, a book event, The Love and Queen Mary, um, which is with Love and Books. Anyway, I realized I was like an hour away from this bookstore and I had to go. I had to fit it into my trip and make it happen because it's been a dream of mine to go in there. Anyway, I went in, I bought um, a signed Penny Reed book that I didn't have already, um, but I also picked this up. It was like a blind date with a book. Now, do you see what this says? It says basically a Hufflepuff's wet dream. Okay, so I am a Ravenclaw and I am a Hufflepuff. So Raven, Puff, Huffleclaw, whatever you want to call it, those are my houses. And um, I wish I had a sorting hat to tell me which one I'd really truly be put in. But as it is, I saw this and I have one idea of what I think it might be, but I'm not sure. But I kept coming back to it, picking up. I just had to have this book. So <laughs> I'm going to open it. I just love the idea of this blind date with a book anyway. Um, they wrapped it really well, so <laughs> I'm gonna start tearing here. Um, where, you know, there's just a little description on the front of each piece of wrapping, and then you just pick, and it's so cool. So um, I was really excited, and um, I just don't even know, this is not what I thought it was gonna be at all, but um, <laughs> I don't know what it is either. I can only see that there's some chest involved. <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Okay, it says, it's by Shelley Laurenston, hot and badgered. Oh, badgered. That's funny. <laughs> okay, I've not heard of this book or this series, but you see it says it's the Honey Badger Chronicles. So I don't know if you know about Honey Badgers because they're sort of, you know, have a huge reputation because their survival is crazy. They're like the strongest, most well-defended little tiny thing you can imagine. This looks like it's going to be like there's a shapeshifter. It says that he's a grizzly shifter. So that's kind of fun. Um, and she's a honey badger shifter. So I have no idea what to expect from that. But um, how exciting. I'm gonna have a blind date with this book. So I sort of thought it was going to be Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell because that is like the friendliest cute book and it's one of my very favorite books. And for me, that's like a Hufflepuff book, right? I wasn't thinking about the whole badger thing. I was thinking about um, super good friendship and um, falling in love with your best friend kind of book. 
Okay, that was my first uh, unopening, unenveloping, unboxing here on YouTube. And uh, when I have book mail in the future, I will do it again. Do you want me to do it again? Leave a comment and let me know what you think. And if you've read any of these books, let me know what you think. I already know I'm going to love the B.B. Easton. I am excited to give this Honey Badger thing a try, even though it's a little bit different than my normal reads. Okay, so if you're into what I'm doing, like subscribe and um you know i'll put links down in the dvd do for um, any of these books and um, my social media and all of that bye